Hey guys, Ghost2K back with another NBA 2K video. Opening night in my fictional My League, the Minotaurs come to visit the Hobgoblins. If you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button, click the bell to get notified of anything new, that way you don't miss a single NBA 2K video. So first game of the season here, a little high-low action as we get it into the Juker. And he lays it in. And working inside the post here, we've got Gatson also muscling his way in for two. Good job, Gatson. And here he gets inside with the dunk. Right now he's one of my favorite players. All I can is he gets another one on the fast break. First quarter, we're up 13 as uh, they use the post two. Cut it down. So we own the first quarter. Warwick comes in off the bench. Plays well here with a nice dunk as he takes the screen the opposite way. And hits another, another jumper. He was hot in the first half. Kept us uh, up as we're in 15 as they sneak behind us. Get the alley-oop. I think that's Lanier. And uh, in the transition game, he's fired up. They got the dunk. And he knocks down the free throw. Oh, this is a beauty here. As Byron Dantley goes in the air and with the left hand posterizes everybody. Here they miss the uh, he misses the three, but we get the rebound. Bayo continuing his good effort as you see Dantley with the little scoop shot. Yeah, I think he got fouled, so he's going to go to the line and he completes the and one up. 12 here in the first half. Things looking good for the Hobgoblins as the Juker gets a dunk inside. Okay, so still in the second quarter here. Nice block. Jukic had a uh, good first half. But uh, I think that was Beasley. Oh, nice alley-oop dunk here. Cutting behind the defense. We're going to play. We're getting used to that. He gets, let's see, is that, uh, oh, Garnett. He gets the foul. First half, I'm thinking, man, 61%. I have to change the sliders. <laughs> Dantley gets us going in the second half. And steps opposite the screen and knocks down. A jumper. Oh, and here, Beasley gets the steal. And Jones gets the offensive rebound and puts it in. And Beasley gets behind the defense. In the third quarter here, Beasley is just going to go off. He does a step back three, and he knocks it down. He's going to have a huge third quarter. And here he knocks down another one. It's either him or Bellamy. It's hard to see. So, tie game now. They've erased our lead. Let's see. Once again, use that screen to get behind the defense. So, we're going inside. We've been trying to punish them in there. And we've done a pretty good job of that. 61 all. And we get caught on the screen. They knock down the three. And they're just killing us from the perimeter and we did the pick and roll and Bayo with a nice roll to the basket he might deserve more minutes he's doing pretty good oh <laughs> is that Beasley with another three and here they're going to get out in trans this is Beasley I know he's going to get into transition and he's going to lay it in Oh, this is nice offensive work by the CPU. Ends up in a high percentage shot as <laughs> Myers dunks it. Here they'll miss the three, but he gets the offensive rebound. And again, I think it's, uh, that might be Bellamy. Between him and Beasley, they were just lights out. Work trying to keep us in it. Spins in the post. So, but we're down eight 
As uh, we're going back inside, I think that was Gatson. Work, feeling it. Long two. And uh, there's Beasley once again with another three. And to end the quarter, to cap off an 18.3 quarter by Beasley, third quarter by Beasley. And they had a 40 point third quarter. Maybe I should uh, reconsider adjusting those sliders, man. So now we've got a double digit deficit. And uh, we look in trouble, but we've seen that play from them, so we ran it ourselves. Another three. So they'd have a good night. I think they hit uh, maybe 10 threes, and we knock one down here, working inside out. As Danley trying to get us back in it, he gets it to the gets to the basket, and Barlow with the dunk and the foul. He's going to go to the line and convert the M1 opportunity, and we're still down 11. Nice pass to Jukic inside. He gets uh, he gets the easy basket. Was that Bellamy? I think that was Bellamy. I in any case, they hit the shot as Dantley with the alley-oop that we saw in practice last time. Nice job by Dantley. Way to share the ball. Here he gets the three. So we're back in it. We're down nine. Got a seven-digit or a single-digit deficit. But they roll to the basket. Back up to nine. We got it back down to seven as Dantley's trying to get us back in it. Here we play some good defense. Dantley's going to come up with a loose ball, and he's going to drive and dunk it. Five-point game. We got a shot here. We got a shot. We got some good defense again. We're getting it out. And Dantley's going to take it all the way to the rim, and he's going to lay it in. And we're only down three with a minute 18. But here, you see Beasley puts the dagger in, and that pretty much does it. As the Minotaur is going on the win, 108-103. With the huge third quarter, I'm going to show you those stats. They scored 40 in the third, our 21. That was that was difference in the game. And this was the third quarter stats for Freeman Beasley. 18 is 4 for 5 from 3 for the quarter. He just killed us. There's the box score. Dantley ended up with 31. Jukic with 20. A couple guys with double figures. Nobody with double. Well, we did have one guy with double figure rebounds. There's Freeman Beasley with his 33. Jones with a double-double. Around the league, the Grim Reapers beat the Werewolves. Demons won. And the Mutants, they lost to the Fire-Breathing Dragons. Yetis got beat to the Zombies. Centaurs, they lost to the Titans, but they had an outstanding performance by another Freeman. Freeman Gentry, fellow Hoosier, puts up a triple-double, had six steals, almost a quadruple-double uh, in the loss. Uh, next up, the Wraith beat the Gnomes, the Satyrs uh, beat the Mothman, and the Furies lost to the Vampires as the Ogres beat the Doppelgangers. And the Sea Monsters go to overtime to beat the Demigods. Full night of action in the league, a few injuries that occurred, nothing major here. Glenn Hendricks of the Titans, he commented on social media, he'll be back as soon as he can. Another injury here with uh, James Gaines, the Satyrs. He hopes to be back soon. And Neil Glockner with a bruised sternum and says, I ain't going to keep him out of the game. All right, so I'm Coach 2K. Got off night to uh, tomorrow. We're going to be practicing. See you in the next video. I'm Coach 2K, and I'll see you on the court.